Well, hi there. I'm Colin M. A.K. The Tone Wizard. Cheers to you and cheers to me. I hope you're doing very well wherever it is that you may happen to be. I'm doing fantastic tonight. Had a great weekend. Uh, capped it off here on Sunday. Took the family to the beach. Got the little guy in the water. Nobody got sunburned. Daddy drank a few beers uh, on the beach. Uh, despite the signs that said that such activity was prohibited. And I, I don't know what kind of world we live in where a man can't enjoy a couple of, you know, responsible beers on the beach in the sun. It's absolutely ridiculous. They had the park rangers going around. They banned the use of barbecues because uh, up here in bc canada where i'm from um we're having quite a dry july so you can't barbecue you can't drink beer like what, what else will they take from us god damn it um so i wanted to do some greta van fleet content i actually had something planned that that is going to be fun eventually when i get it done um i was going to look at some guitar looks and play some guitar looks by them but the little micro amp that i use to kind of easily go into my audio interface crapped out on me it needs a battery charge um so that's not going to happen today but conveniently i noticed that greta van fleet um, put up a live video on their channel not two days ago, and it's the Indigo Streak um, live. And I think it's from the same footage um, as the video that I, I covered um, a couple of weeks ago on the channel um, for the Falling Sky live. So let me know if that's right, but I think it is from the look of it and from the sound of it. And I also wanted, before before I get into the video, I wanted to thank some new subscribers that have come my way via the Greta Van Fleet stuff that I've been putting out. Uh, and I'll just name a few here. Jody Bennett, thank you very much for your comments. Donna Collins, thank you. Gail8153, thank you very much much dylan jones thank you very much for your comments i appreciate it and carla mabrito thank you very much for those comments and for subscribing to the channel i appreciate it and as you can tell if you've been following along with the videos i do respond to the comments so if you have anything to say um please let me know down below but without further ado let's get right into it okay so this is greta van fleet the Indigo Streak, it's from their brand new um, 2023 album, Starcatcher, and it is live. So let's check this thing out here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, it's going Elvis there. Woo! That one always makes me emotional. It does. It always gets me at the end. I'm like, oh, fuck, I'm supposed to sing this thing, you know, so keep it together. All right, like I said, tonight's a very special night. Look at that goddamn that said, suit. We'd like to share something with you. Is that, is that a crotch bulge? I feel all right that's with a, that that's, kind of secret information. <laughs> that's, that's a decent crotch bulge. Um, I actually have done a video, <laughs> a video about Robert, kind of pertaining to Robert Plant's crotch bulge. Not, not enough people are rocking the crotch bulge anymore. Say the mixing of this one is, is to my ears a little better than the last one. This sounds fucking hot. Lots of reverb in there, lots of liveness to it. Attack on that vocal. Musically, this one's a little more got a little more going on than a few of the other ones that I've checked out. Michael Anthony happened in there. Oh, 
This is fucking cooking. I, I would love to be at this concert. They're making the drummer sweat a little bit here. Just that big vocal and guitar explosion. That was fucking hot. And I want to talk about that guitar tone in a second. was fucking epic that, that's what that was that sounded massive um if, if you know i've covered people talking shit about this band on my channel um and i don't really want to get into all that again i find that a lot of the criticisms are, are lazy and uninventive and i think i've said something to this this effect before but you know it's it's easier to just be negative and to in, invoke people's kind of toxic negativity um, and not be creative about it than it is to talk about something you're passionate about and make it interesting and and have some analysis to it. So, uh, I mean, anybody who wants to talk shit about this band should just watch that live video because that's a fucking cooking band, pardon my Francais, um, man. But that guitar sound was epic, even just right from the get-go. It sounds like they're getting a big kind of a, a roomy sound of that. Like they're trying to capture this. That sounded like it would sound if you were sitting there versus rather than a crystal clear recording. And that guitar tolo zone was amazing. I, I could be wrong, but I think I heard like a bit of a rotary effect on there and a wah, and it just sounds great. It sounds like really loud amps cranked up to the point of utter destruction. And uh, man, I would love to be at that show because that was fantastic. And I got to watch that again because there was some subtleties going in there that you know, and pardon me for not being an expert on Greta Van Fleet, but that I haven't heard in some of their other songs. And by God, do I do I salute a crotch bulge? Um, and I think I've got a, a picture that I made about crotch bulges that I could put up here now. But truthfully, um, that was that was excellent. And you know what? I'm kind of working on a full album review um, of this album, and I want to spend some time with the album. And I and I'm I'm now that I know these videos are coming out, I'm not really in any hurry um, to get through it. But at some point on the channel, I'm going to have a full album review there. And uh, maybe I'm going to check out and see. I, I think uh, I, I, somebody commented on one of the previous videos that they've done a couple of rig rundowns, which I definitely did see one of those rig rundowns. But I want to check out and see if there's anything most recently or see if I can find anything on any of the various gear sites. But I really enjoyed that video. That's a cooking rock song. The drummer actually looked like he was pushed to a little bit of sweat there. He's got to watch those little face dazzles if He's going to be playing like that in the future, but I'm sure they've got that covered. But yeah, I really enjoyed that. Let me know what your comments are down below. Um, and if you've enjoyed this video, please um, feel free to check out some of the other stuff I do on the channel. Subscribe and take very good care of yourselves. I'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.